and so many other things. I give you my heart. Wonderful day to you, wonderful masterpiece of this universe. My name is Hyrene, and welcome back to our YouTube channel, The Virtual Punso. So if you're new to this channel, please do consider subscribing or hitting the notification bell button or the subscribe button so that you won't miss out on any of my upcoming videos. In this short video, I'll be sharing to you three things that can make us happier than money. Here is number one. Self-compassion. <laughs> So on the last week of July, I decided to enroll myself in an online course which is entitled The Science of Happiness, hosted by the University of California, Berkeley. And yay, I earned myself a certificate last August for having been able to complete everything or to pass the exam. And that's not important at all. What's more important is that I'm going to share to you some of the things or some of the lessons that I've learned from this course. And some of the things that I've learned from this course are the three components of self-compassion, which are namely number one, self-kindness versus self-judgment. It's like treating yourself with care and love and also not being so harsh to yourself or rude or mean to yourself whenever you commit mistakes or you fail at something. And then number two is common humanity versus isolation. So what does it mean? So it's this feeling that it's not just me. It's not just me who suffers like this or it's not just me who's experiencing this. And this is totally normal to experience pain. This is the complete human experience. That's according to Christine Neff. Self-compassion, according to Christine Neff, is the practice of quieting the inner critic, replacing it with a voice of support, understanding, and care for oneself. And the next one is mindfulness versus over-identification. So it means being aware of your suffering or your pain for you to be able to develop compassion towards yourself. And that brings us to number two relationships relationships i guess are a fundamental element in human happiness and there's this survey which was conducted in relation to this which shows that latin american countries have a higher happiness index compared to high income countries why is that so because of their relationships they put so much importance or emphasis to their relationships and it's actually in their culture to put the needs of others first before themselves or to consider the feelings of others before themselves. And I think this is a really good practice. If you try to think deeply about it, it's a very simple thing, but it is what is most important. And so let's go now to number three, healthy habits. I guess what you do first thing in the morning contributes so much or place a big role on how your day would actually turn out to be. So it's more important or it's very important to develop a healthy daily routine. One of the most wonderful things that I've learned from this virus-induced self-imprisonment or quarantine is to not grab my phone first thing in the morning, but rather grab something or grab a good book which could feed my mind and soul. Da -da -da -da. Another healthy habit is finding time to exercise, but this can be the most difficult task ever because what we initially think about exercise is that it's uncomfortable and it really is because you can be sweaty and you can just, I mean, choose to lie on your bed and spend the last 20 minutes of your time before work to just rest and chill and relax. But we know for a fact that exercise is very important and as well beneficial to the body. Both meditation and exercise are really game changers. They can rewire your brain to become more resilient, more productive, and it gives you a higher sense of well-being. And that's it for my short video, guys. I hope you have learned something very beneficial from this video. And if you did, please do not forget to share like, subscribe, and this is once again your elf friend, Tyreen, reminding you to stay safe, stay healthy, stay sane, 
and don't let the bad elves get you till my next video thank you so much for watching bye bye ciao